Thank you. You too. Have a good, have a good. All right, what's up guys? So, me and Jawah headed to uh, Abraham's house with the Shelby to install the clutch. And uh, I'm gonna show you guys, I'll take the camera. So I'm gonna show you guys how this, this car slips. All right, I'm in fifth gear right now. If I floor this shit, the, it doesn't even grip, watch. Like, that shit just, do you feel yeah, that? Yeah, like, that does not grip. At all. So, uh, yeah, I gotta keep on driving, Joel's gonna take over, but nah, did you feel that slip? Yeah, no, it slipped, bad. Nah, so. Yeah, it slipped pretty bad, hopefully it's a cloud clutch will fix it. Yeah, I don't know if I'll film the install, because who wants to watch the install video, but. <laughs> Alright guys, so we made it to the uh, HH race shop. Uh, we're gonna make a trip, uh, we're gonna make a quick stop at AutoZone cause we need to get, what, we need to get tranny oil and then uh, we'll be on the road. We're gonna drop the tranny tonight and uh, update you guys. So we'll see you guys soon. Take the Shelby. Quick gas stop. Yep. You know we have Chevron. This car is dirty, dude. It needs a detail. Need a detail by, by AA detailing. <laughs> Chevron Techron overpriced gas. We're just go getting some lights right now. Um, Abraham was lagging again, <laughs> and uh, we're gonna get some lights, and then we'll be back to the uh, HH race shop, and uh, see you guys then. We got the mod chilling. This is it right here. The Cobra up in the air. Looking like Lightning McQueen through the air. Lightning McQueen. With the tongue sticking out. Cobra's stupid. I'm trying out this new filter thing. It's the auto, the auto color mode. I don't even know. It looks cool. So we'll try it out. But uh, we should have enough clearance to hopefully get everything situated down there. The Cobra looks pretty nice. The the fat 305s look pretty good. 335s coming soon. Oh, it got God, bro. It's out. She's out. Tomorrow's quest will be checking out how the clutches. Cobra, Cobra's hibernating for the uh, morning, should I say? I know we stayed up all night, guys, and the sky's already blue. And now we're going to get McDonald's because, yeah, we're starving, bro. Got the transmission out. All we need left is the clutch we're going to assemble the clutch and then uh we're going to put the uh input shaft on the transmission uh joel's dad might be able to do it but uh if not we'll just have a shop do it and see where we go from there so we'll pick it up tomorrow probably but we're going to head to mcdonald's because we're starving yep all right in the morning Stay all right cover it peace moment of truth Press that button. yeah when we ordered it oh you, you bought it yeah oh you did oh he did it oh you did it. nice oh. she's a tight one she's yeah. good all right, guys. So, uh, when I say us, I mean Cameron here. Uh, unbolted the uh, flywheel hold bolts. Hold on, hold on. I was under the. No, no, not the flywheel bolts. Hold on. Just took the dust in his eye. Yeah. yeah. So, we got the. Hey, we got the pressure plate out. We got the pressure plate out. No. Yeah. Let me let up. me let me update the vlog. We got the pressure plate out. The flywheel is on the car, so that's what we're taking out. There's a bunch of heat marks, and it's just all bad. But we're gonna take it out. And when I say so, we, this guy right here, he didn't know how to drive, so it, yeah, it just it just the clutch just hey hey flat, <laughs> flash back to the day we got the Cobra, and I was shifting at like 5,000 RPM.
All right, what's up, guys? So we're doing, we're taking a little break on the clutch right now. In the meantime, we're gonna wait for Abraham a little bit, right? And then yeah. we'll install the uh, flywheel. But um, currently, we're installing this throttle body we got from AccuFab. I paid about 500 for it. It's a little expensive, but with this power setup, I could be making potentially around 475 to 480 wheel horsepower. Can you that monkey right so that'll be some pretty nice gains. Um, I do have a new tune coming as well. And uh, this car only has a, what, three bolt-ons, right? It's yeah. got a smaller pulley. It's got an idler pulley so the belt doesn't slip. It's got this throttle body. It's got a K&N FIPK intake kit. It's like just this part right here. And, uh, and that's it. we got an off-road exhaust and that's it. So with this setup, I mean, these cars make decent power. Um, hopefully down the line we get to get some Whipple, Whipple foot, power. get some Whipple power in there. Yeah. But uh, we're just installing this kit for now. The tune's coming. It's not tune required, but uh, you're obviously going to get the most gains with a good tune. So we're going to wait on the tune um, and we'll upload it. So hopefully everything goes well and we'll see you guys in the next step, which is the flywheel. Yep. Peace out and keep moving forward. What? Hey, can you see the clutch from here? Oh, it's good. Yeah, you can. Yo. It's because there's the clamp. They couldn't get it on. Damn. Sounds good. Sounds good. It pops. That pops nice. Hey, with the intake, you can hear it, huh? Yeah. Oh, I oh, about the outside, that. you can hear the intake. It does. Yeah, it was. That sounded good. It's like, it doesn't sound loud inside. So me, Cameron, and Joel are currently um, doing, we're taking a break from the, the clutch install. Um, nah. It's everything's pretty much set. We just gotta put the transmission in, then put all the rest of the parts, drive shaft, starters, exhaust, stuff like that. So currently, um, I also did put a bigger throttle body and plenum on the Cobra. So what we're doing now is we're gonna upload the custom tune to my tuner. I haven't done this before because <coughs> my dad's car was, <coughs> All on my phone. Bam. Bam. <coughs> sucks. But uh, we have a VMP tune now that I got revised, and uh, the car should run good with it. I won't be able to do anything crazy with it, but um, yeah. we will see you guys when we get the tune uploaded. So see you guys soon. So now, currently, where we are with the install is we do have the new tune uploaded to the tuner. Um, that's a base tune, so I just do have to data log, but I can't because the clutch is going in. And because of that, you know, you can't go wide open throttle on a brand new clutch. You gotta just break send that it. in. Just huh? send it. We're gonna send just it. Just send no, it for the boys. No. <laughs> but uh, no, we're gonna wing it, I guess, and see how it goes. Cameron and I are, and Joel are gonna try and put the tranny in. I don't think it's gonna go well, but okay. hey, we're gonna try it. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next clip, all right? What's up, guys? So it's day like, it's been about, f it's been two weeks since the first day we started the clutch. Um, but now we're hopefully going to finish it up. We had some problems yesterday. Today, hopefully the tranny should be fully going in and everything should be running smoothly. So we'll update you guys. I'm going to pick up Joel and we'll see you guys there. As you guys can see, we are day 600,225 up into this bitch. But, uh, we've made some progress. I don't know when the last time update you guys, but the transmission is now in place with the drive line. We got the factory aluminum drive shaft in in place all we need to do is put the uh, exhaust in yeah. and call it a day 
We're gonna test it out. Fill it with oil. oil yeah, fresh. need to do a. We got some synchro mesh, four quarts. We're gonna fill it from the top. Seems to be the best. Just pour it in like that. Like you're peeing, you know. Psst. And uh, hopefully, next part of this video is uh, starting the Cobra. We got the clutch basically installed. We still have to adjust it and stuff, but Joel's gonna feel how light the clutch is because I just felt it. it feels real nice. See if it's really light, light or not. Yeah, nah, that shit feels good. It's light. Oh, yeah, that's hella light. That feels good, doesn't it? Yeah, that feels way better than stock. Hell yeah. This makes your stock one feel like hella heavy. It feels good though. I mean, it's like, it's not any like a, like a no, hydraulic good. one, but it feels nice. Yeah, no, it feels good for sure. All right, all right, boys. We got the the what? We got. I'm so excited. We got the oil in the car. Um, now all that we have left is to connect the battery terminals and then put the new tuner in for the new in, uh, the new throttle body and hopefully this bitch works. <laughs> Three, two, go ahead. Are you gonna rev it? Like barely anything. Holy shit. I started, I was like, what's that whoosh sound? It sound, yo, it sounds like the mock when you first step on it because of the throttle body. Yeah, I'll drop by soon, alright? That whoosh sound is fucking loud too. Shit. It's loud. You gotta adjust it. Yeah? Yeah, it's like, check out the street. Yeah. Yo, it's so guys we got the cobra up and going after two weeks the clutch is engaging really nicely hopefully everything goes well but damn <laughs> that throttle body man holy shit the gas is so much more sensitive this shit's gonna be hauling sounds good i'm gonna check the oil but damn holy hold up dude this bitch fucking it's not even warm but holy shit bro huh we're gonna do we'll go up a little bit Hold up, let's see. We'll go backwards. <laughs> We're gonna take it on our first drive. I'm kind of hyped. Let's we'll see. Are you ready? Yep. How's the? Oh, the that feels nice. Yeah? It engages the really nice. Engage point is good. It's sensitive the, as fuck. The throttle body? Yeah. Yeah, it'll be it'll be a lot more sensitive. That's how the mocks was. I'm shifting good, I mean, yeah. it feels all right. Not just yet. Woo! Sounds good. Oh, yeah, dude, that fucking looks crazy. She's back, though. She's back. <laughs> 